Hey everyone, so I just got a box from Dan Classic and we gotta take a look at it right now. Uh, I already opened it up ahead of time, but I haven't checked inside. And of course, since I stickered it up with all these weird, this side up, and then if you turn it that side up, it's like, oh no, but it's this side up. So I have all these uh, stickers on there for them. Um, fragile, it wasn't fragile and heavy. How is this thing heavy? So um, once I'm done with this and I get more stuff for him, I'm gonna sticker it back up with even more stickers since he added the stapler and the jello, vans, of course, we got we got a Gumby right there because he likes Gumby. Um, I don't know what that is. It looks like a praying mantis or something. It's better than spooning the crunch cup. So never, I think it's like a cereal thing, I don't know. Um, and then we got Yo-Yo Expert right there. And I thought I saw another Yo-Yo sticker on here. Ah, uh, here we go, yoyotricks.com. So I'll be putting some more stickers on this and then he's going to do another video when he gets his box. But um, <clears throat> that probably won't be for a while because I have to, uh, yeah, I have to get some more stuff for him. So let's check out what he sent over. And whoa, already. <clears throat> he filled it all the way to the top. That's awesome. So we got some uh, Masters of the Universe uh, Mega Constructs. So that's cool. There's Man at Arms. And then there's, um, let's see. Oh, there's Evil Lynn. I don't think I have this one. Yeah, I don't think I have this one. So that's awesome. I don't even think I have this Man at Arms either. So this is like the darker green one. I don't have him. And then there's some, oh yeah, Nano Metal Figs. I got some um, Nano Metal Figs that are, they're just, uh, you can't get them in a five pack. You have to get them in the solo pack. And that's the Squidward Nano Metal Fig. That's uh, two of them. And then the uh, the underwear SpongeBob Nano Metal Fig. So when the Nickelodeon figures came out, um, this was the only way to get these two figures was just in that box or in the um, the solo packs. Um, yes, a Gumby. So. Um, my history with Gumby is I've never had like one of these. I had a, like a short one <clears throat> and that's it. But I've never had like a, a regular size Gumby. So this is really cool. I actually saw um, his girlfriend, which is the, the pink one right there. I've seen, I saw her at the swap meet um, la like two weeks, three weeks ago. So um, so that's cool. So yeah, I had the uh, the mini gumbies let's see oh we got some muscles so that's oh and <laughs> one of the boxes opened up but this is great this this is really cool that we i got some we got some wwe muscles from super seven and the reason why this is cool actually two boxes opened up uh the reason it's cool is because i'm doing a um tiny monster month in march and one of the things I'm going to be talking about is um, is the muscles. So um, this is the WWE ones. And it looks like I no longer have to uh, open them up because these ones have already <laughs> opened up. So they got Magneto. So this is really awesome. It's uh, Marvel Legends Magneto from the um, Apocalypse Build-A-Figure. Um, this is the last piece that I needed. So for about a year, year and a half, I've had a, um, an apocalypse with one arm missing. So now I finally get to complete, uh, my apocalypse build a figure. And on top of that, it's Magneto. So that's cool. I don't have any Magnetos. Um, I'm not sure exactly which one is this one from, but, um, it's the black and red one. So... I don't have a lot of villains, but this is great. Thank you so much for this. And then uh, for all you Lenard fans out there, these have already been reviewed in Dan Classic's channel. So I'll put the link for this review down below. But I got to do this uh, Raz Holly style. We got Kung Fu Takeout. And um, yeah, so it, we got uh, all four of the figures. So... I'll be able to finally review 
Kung Fu takeout for all you Lennart people. Um, I'll be doing this. I'm not sure when, but I already started writing it. And um, Dan wasn't able to really uh, read off that part. Uh, I speak Spanish and I can read it, so I'll, uh, I'll go ahead and translate that in the video when we get to it. Um, I think I'm going to... I don't think I think I'm gonna do this as one set because there's no extra like file card or anything on these guys it's all the same packaging so this is just gonna be one video on these um, I'll go ahead and mention the uh, dragon doe figures and also the um, the core uh, super soldiers I do have um, let's see this guy right here so this is this guy's name Chop Suey. So I do have Chop Suey, aka Slash, in the core Super Soldier. Um, now I just got to try to find some of those Dragon Doe figures, and I know those are really hard to find. But um, yeah, so Lenard's gonna get quite a few different reviews coming up. Uh, we got Kung Fu Takeout. We got Predator and the new Alien stuff. So I already got that. Um, I just got to start writing it. I just photographed everything yesterday for that series. Um, I need to do a couple more photos, but it's pretty much all set up. And then uh, any other Lenard stuff? Uh, yes, I'll be doing Time Crisis, but that's not going to be until later on in the year. So you're looking at probably in the fall. So you got a while for that. Um, that's just kind of what I'm thinking with everything that I got going on. So, um, uh, yeah, I think that's about it for Lenard stuff. And that's about it for the Dan Classic box. And Dan Classic does a weekly uh, video there, like a stream, uh, every Tuesday. So you can go to Collector's Dungeon every Tuesday, 2 p.m., about 2 p.m. Eastern. Um, and I believe it's 11 uh, Pacific. So you can check that out. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this quick unboxing and super duper quick um, update since now we have these guys. I could start finish writing this one and then we'll see when these come out. Maybe in the summer after I'm done with Alien and Predator. But anyway, we'll see you on the next video.